Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to do an unboxing from Shop Factory, so stick around. So recently Shop Factory had a sale on their box sets and there were some sets that I really wanted to take advantage of that I didn't have in the collection. So I did go ahead and order quite a few titles, well some titles, but some larger titles that I've been wanting to pick up. So I thought I would take the time today to unbox this and show you what all I got. So they did a great job with the packing. Um, I will list the um, price that I paid for each of these items as they are shown on the screen. So first up we have Casper the Friendly Ghost, the complete collection. This right here is from 1945 to 1963. I grew up watching these, um, I guess in syndication. Really nice little thin set. So very happy to have these in the collection. Most of these are DVDs, or I guess half and half. Um, I did get the complete collector's edition of Underdog which is in this thick case, no slipcover or anything with it. Um, but another um, cartoon that I watched growing up. Another one is the complete collection of tennis, Tennessee Tuxedo and his tails. Um, didn't have this one in the collection. I do vaguely remember some of these, but not very many. Um, but another animated title that I wanted to add to the collection. And then I got um, Beetlejuice, the complete series. Nice little box set. I love um, I love Beetlejuice, the movie. I never do remember having seen the cartoons. I think I was actually older at the time that these came out. But it does come with all 94 episodes. So really great addition to the collection. Okay, next up I got JFK Revisited. The Complete Collection. This is an Oliver Stone film. Um, I really enjoyed JFK the movie that Oliver Stone did. And so this is a nice probably documentary about all of that. So very happy to have that one on Blu-ray. And then these next two titles are what I really wanted and very happy to finally have them in the collection. First up we have The Six Million Dollar Man, The Complete Series. Um, the Blu-ray Collector's Edition, all individually um, housed in their own cases. Now, I did grow up watching The Six Million Dollar Man. I love the series. Um, I did not ever buy the DVD sets, so I'm very happy that I was able to get these on Blu-ray. And, of course, I couldn't get The Six Million Dollar Man without getting The Bonnick Woman, uh, which I really love this series also. Um, Lindsay Wagner's amazing. Very fun show. Um... Probably, probably um, some people probably wouldn't like it. I did go and rewatch some of these. Um, I think uh, I forgot what streaming service I was watching these on, but they are a little corny. Um, but I've got a lot of nostalgia for these, and I really do enjoy these. So very happy to have these in the collection. I think Shop Factory does a great job with their TV series. I wish that they would do more, especially the Obscure series. I know that they had some other box sets that I was interested in. Um, but anyways, very happy to have these in the collection. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about these particular box sets that I purchased. And let me know if you have any of these in your collection. Because um, I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and on Twitter. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I have all of those linked down below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.